Hey guys, welcome to another video of Small Engine Nation. My name is Phil. Today we have an Aaron's 1130 DLE. This is actually my personal snowblower. And I just wanna make a video today on how to adjust the shoes and the scraper bar. Now, when you do adjust your shoes, you actually do adjust your scraper bar. And the reason you'd adjust your scraper bar is because you actually don't want the scraper bar to scrape the ground when you snow blow. Now it might seem weird that the scraper bar is named scraper bar and it seems like the blade would actually uh, scrape the blade or scrape the ground but in reality you do not want the scraper bar or scraper blade to scrape the ground. You want actually to be raised about a quarter to half an inch. Now if you have the same model of Aaron snowblower as I do the scraper shoe nuts are 9 16 so I have a 9 16 3 8 socket and a 3 8 uh, new, uh, I'm sorry, battery operated Milwaukee ratchet. And I do have a 11 16 wrench. You will see why in a moment. I'm actually just going to be using this end to put underneath the scraper bar to kind of give me that quarter to half inch uh, distance from the ground. Now what you want to do next is simply, if you're going to be using the wrench method, go ahead and lift onto the auger chute and set the wrench right underneath. Now this will give you your quarter inch clearance from the ground, which is perfect. We're uh, right where we want to be. Now simply go ahead and loosen up the nuts here on the shoe. And also this is a good time to inspect your shoe. As you can see, my one of the halves are completely rusted apart. Um, this half cannot be used anymore, so I flipped it last year, and this year it's still good, so we're going to be reusing this side. So go ahead and loosen up the nuts. You don't need to take them completely off. Now, as you can see, the shoe dropped all the way. So we're just going to tap it a bit and go ahead and tighten it up. Like so. And I'll do the same exact thing to the other side. So we're going to go ahead and loosen up these nuts. Tap on the shoe a little bit and tighten it up. Like so. And now you can simply remove the wrench. And if you see, you have that clearance right here which is perfect. You have clearance straight across. And that is basically all there is to adjusting the shoes and scraper bar on your Aaron's 1130 DLE snowblower. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a comment down below if you have a question. Hit that like if you liked the video. And also be sure to subscribe for more videos coming your way. We're working hard and tis the season almost where the snow's about to drop and we are gonna be demoing some snowblower units. I got a brand new one right there. And we're also gonna be doing some live action with this 30 inch snowblower. Take care guys.